Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Thursday night. Shmup Book Club. We're gonna go back to Karis. Um, I did play this quite a bit since last time I played it, which was, what, two, three weeks ago, maybe? Managed to pull up 1.7 billion uh, with a B and an all-clear. So we gotta beat that tonight somehow. Um, unlikely to happen, but, you know, we'll never know unless we try. Uh, let's get connected up to the club. Looks like we're the first ones here. Uh, we'll, we'll see uh, who else decides to join tonight and what they're playing. Um, oh boy, I gotta remember what the fuck I'm gonna do here. Yeah, I gotta remember what I'm doing on, on the old Karis. Might be troublesome. <clears throat> Well, I... that seals that, huh? <laughs> get that all clear. Try to get that all clear. Uh, you know. Let's get past uh, Dipshit Stage 3 boss and sight read the rest. Oh, okay. Well, uh, you know, sight read Stage 4 boss and then the rest, I guess. Oh boy. I'm fucking this up already. Got that going for it. as bad as initially thought.
<laughs> oh, thank you. Where is it frozen? Yeah, I figured. I'll get a pause so I can fix that. Oh, yeah, it did. Very contemplative little thing there. Excellent. Well, that's easy enough solved. Yeah, it's just that easy, huh? I mean, some of it's useful. <laughs> the, the majority is not <laughs> particularly good. Oh, my goodness. I mean, sure, if you've got a spare moment to look at it. Oh, eh, you know, there you go. What else are you gonna do, I guess?
Oh crap, reduce that volume. Sure does. It's gotta be sure that all its ROM is in place, I guess. Yeah, natural-ish back shot is pretty good. Something like that, yeah. I didn't have to wait for the screen. <laughs> there's something to let's see. There's something to do with points too. Huh? That if they don't do like a, a crash explode on the background, you don't get the full points for them. At least that's really? what I've seen. Wait, really? Is yeah. it not? Is it not just the pickup thing? It's not just the pickup thing, and that seems random on its mm. own too. Well, I was thinking that was only if they crash onto land or something. No. No, that one crashed onto land right now and it didn't drop anything. Yeah, Maybe it's, it's, the type of it's thing weird. Too. I don't know. Haven't uh, quite. Randomness in my schmuck? Science no, that yeah, one fully. Can't believe it. <laughs> you know, I'm not playing Corridor 7 this week. I thought I was done with randomness. Nah, yeah, well, you thought wrong. Oh yeah, speaking of shmups I'm not playing, I was just uh, mentioning this to the stream before I got onto Discord, but there, I didn't end up, I, I've been trying a bunch of uh, Next Fest demos, but I did not get any shmups. I almost tried one shmup called Signy All Guns Blazing because it struck me as like, hmm, this kind of seems like it's trying to be Revo except way more visually noisy. Oh, well, that's uh, But that's giving great. it way too much credit. Um, oh, that's even Signy worse. doesn't know what it wants to be. Signy is very confused about what shmups are. If anything, it's kind of Euro shmuffy because you have a shield, you're expected to absorb hits. Um, there's a lot going on because, like, there's... There's a couple of types of main shot because you can switch between homing and not. Uh, there is a lock on. There's air and ground targeting. And before EI gets excited, um, yeah, it's just that there's so much stuff going on. There's also like you have to like switch oh, between. How is this my uh, uh, Targeting air and ground, I guess, is what I got out of that, right? The lock on. Thing. I don't there understand we go, the how that's something. I... I don't know, man. Don't you like that? I like it. I mean, lock guns are fun, but like, I wasn't aware that this is now a signature. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, it's either that or getting hit by the one bullet. Right? On the screen. See? Oh, I haven't what do you even want? Been doing that that much lately, so I don't know what y'all think of, has been going on around. Well, then here. accept that you're excited about lock guns, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, but there's like. 
there's so there's there's juggling all of that. There's also like switching between attack and defense because like you can focus energy into your shield so that it recharges, I guess. Hmm. Okay. There's just there's a lot. It seems like many a mechanic um, going on there. And if you're not focusing your attack into your like if you're not focusing your energy into your weapons, then you're probably not going to kill anything because like things are tanky if you aren't putting power into attack. I mean, part of it could be that Cypherin was still getting the hang of it, because I was watching him play it um, a couple nights ago. But it definitely seemed like it is very possible to make it so that you can't kill things. And, like, some of it... I, I For a minute, I was... Oh, I just picked up missiles, apparently. Well, I didn't want that. Um, for a minute, I was worried that it was, like, bugging out at 120 hertz or something. Wow, I can't believe that bulb didn't hit me. But no, it seemed like like some some of the enemy aircraft just like move extremely oddly and quickly. It's like you wouldn't expect them to do that. So yeah, I I don't have much. I mean, it's it's just like I wanted to be able to like it because like Konami's publishing it. You figure, well, Konami's publishing a video game. Um. Hey, wait! I you thought mean, you didn't. Of our corporate overlords, 2024. Did what? you? Didn't no. you not play it because of the whole Eula third-party Eula thing or? I didn't, but okay. uh, oh, I, yeah, but you can still see the publisher. Yeah, yeah. Um, and also, I saw I watched Cypher and play. Right, right, right. Because it so happened that he, you know, he had he had the same he was interested in the same thing, and he didn't let the EULA stop him. I, I was like, you know, I got ten other things to play. I can ditch this one. Yeah, you know, that's kind I, of the I didn't issue with last that event. I think stuff. I downloaded. I think I played seventeen demos. I scaled down. Although that might be counting the ones that I like tried for three minutes and then uninstalled. Which there were a couple of those this time too. Even outside of the EULA ones. Um There was Biomorph, which seems like it's probably going for slightly souls like met uh slightly souls like Metroidvania. But it seemed like the slightly bosses slightly. I say slightly, slightly because like I watched Cypher and play it and it seemed like the bosses don't take five years to kill, so I think slightly. Lightly used um, souls like as opposed Never to worn. as opposed to so that was Biomorph, but that had flashing on full screen lightning flashing on the title screen, which apparently they have mm. adjusted. because uh, I good. kind of rudely yeah. commented on that because I'm so sick of games doing that. Um but apparently they switched it so that it's only doing it like once every 90 seconds because the loop on the title screen actually has to like, you know, transition then or something. So like, <laughs> they left it to cover that up, but that's it. Um, oh, but then there was, so it's it's funny that there's there's multiple souls like starting with bio because there's bio, that was bio more, uh, where the shtick is, yeah, you kind of like steal enemies abilities. <clears throat> Okay. Uh, and then there's Bio Gun. Oh, I disagree with that. Um, there's Bio Gun, which is apparently I missed the memo on this, and this there was oh, no like souls like tag in the store page for it. But Bio Gun is literally what if you had Hollow Knight with guns. <laughs> so I did not survive uh, any. I, might, I don't know if there was like a tutorial boss that I survived, but beyond that, there I did not survive any losses. In that. I saw Cypher and play that, and he he fared much better than I did. But there's no boss life bars in that game, and I'm kind of like I would like to like know how far away from victory I am. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's ridiculous. Why would you need that? Nah, too much. Asking too much there. It is interesting though because uh, Biogun actually has like. Instead of a corpse run, the, you do drop something where you die, but it actually just like gives you unlimited energy for a certain amount of time or something. Like it's a power up instead of you lost stuff and have to get it back. Interesting. Whoa! Can't believe. Wait. Oh, okay. That was yeah. That hit me, and I lost my purple thing. Oh, also, if you get the flashy P while you're also while you're already full of fully powered, you get like thirty fucking power up drops. Wait, what? In the song the, Purple Pea we're talking about? In the Shinryu, the little flashy P thing, yeah. Huh. Yeah, that's wild. Kind of, well, if I hadn't kind of died... Of course, they, those seem to show up randomly too, so you know, good luck getting one when you actually want it. I feel like I 
it's always oh well i drove right into that one um i uh i feel like it i don't know i feel like i've seen it near the beginning of stage three multiple times i know, I know it seems like the start of stage five has a guaranteed one but oh sugar <laughs> Yeah, that was the, what are the Whoa. wait? That was a lot of dudes at the top of the screen right there, taunting me as I game over. I don't know if I've seen that many dudes at once before. Maybe they just usually die fast. Okay. And now we have to wait for like the six in the continue. You can press start to get it down faster before the six. Oh. Okay. But then after six, you can just auto fire normal shot, and then it's fine. <laughs> That's a weird. It, it's <laughs> very weirdly separate for some reason. Yeah, well, especially since start would also continue if you had credits. Right. This game is lucky its music at the beginning is good. It's like that old Pro ZD uh, clip of uh, uh, fucking shit, and then the uh, the flying machine shovel knight music st plays, and he starts bothering. <laughs> he's like, I I'm so mad. <laughs> Eventually the Shovel Knight, uh, Zach has been playing the Messenger, and Ooh, I'm probably nice. going to play it soon. Like, I, I didn't really want anything to do with it initially, so I was like, I'm not sure if I'm up for that kind of game, but now that I've played Celeste, I'm like, yeah, I should play the Messenger. Oh, I did not pick that up. That was, like, off-screen. Oh, you got it. Alright, fine. <laughs> Apparently oh, pickups are pretty generous, and, like, if there's even a pixel still on screen, you can pick it up. Oh, bastard. Look at how many missiles I'm hitting this guy with and he's not dying. Like, seriously, you'd think these missiles would pack a little more punch than that. They do seem to be the weakest weapon overall. Unless you're really pounding away with the direct fire missiles. Then they're pretty good. The homing ones, not so much. Three bombs as the first boss was dying. Yeah, that's a fun little section right at the end. Makes me wonder how much stuff you can farm for there. You do this, like, because, like, I mean, it, that stuff will start happening before the boss even dies. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It really depends how much you want to stick around in that fight. Uh, okay, surprise, there was a missile drop in there somewhere. <laughs> there was just like a pile of crap. And I didn't see a missile drop in there. Oh, jeez. different bomb when you're on a different weapon. Ow. 
Yeah, the missile bomb kind of sucks, so, uh... I'm on Vulcan right now. That one's not so bad. I actually like that one the best, but... I'm, I'm not really clear on how much it does. It at least does more or less a full screen protection for you. More or less. <laughs> more or less. More consistently than the lightning bomb. Any rate. Mm, yeah, the lightning bomb, you have to pay attention to where the lasers are, because that's where it's protecting. That's mm -hmm. where it's destroying bullets and stuff. Yeah. Because, yeah, I have definitely gotten kind of screwed by that. Starting pattern. Uh, thanks for that, I guess. Oh, yep, yeah, there's the power of wheel. Holy crap. Oh, nice. Yeah, hopefully you and end up with that. just sail off the screen. Correct weapon <laughs> once uh, all of it's gone. Yeah, I just bonk into one of the missile pickups again. And I'm using all my bombs now because holy crap, everything is mad at me. I didn't like that you uh, unlocked the power of wheel. <laughs> the rank does Very seem. Ascended. Very aggressive <laughs> when you get all the stuff. That's all my bonds. Yep. All right. So now we're probably screwed. Oh, I accidentally picked up the weapon I actually want. Okay. Didn't even see where it was. That bomb just passed me too. Oh, that was. Oh, jeez. I still have the P. That's pretty funny. Like the, the extra hit. Got away with something, did you? Yeah, you because know, I used like a gazillion bombs. Ah, uh, well, <laughs> yeah, getting away with it, but it cost you. <laughs> like that's why I got Probably away with it. Getting away with it. No oh, crap. All right, it's octopus time or whatever. Oh no, it's turret time apparently. Shouldn't be panicking that early in the boss fight, jeez. Oh, man. Ended up in a bad position finally. Oh, are you fighting ultra wide, boy? Uh, no. No? Third boss, octopus. Oh, third boss, yeah, okay. Okay, 
Yeah, I was gonna say, I thought eventually he does spicy attacks. Here they are. Oh, yeah. What? Okay, my electricity is sometimes getting distracted by irrelevant things, I think. Yeah, that definitely Whoa, that was seems to target off-screen things sometimes, too, for some gosh-forsaken reason. I think it takes way too long to die. And honestly, the flash of tentacles when you're damaging it are kind of distracting. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, at least I got to stage four again once tonight. I don't remember what my PP was. I'll have to look it up after this. I hope this is gonna be a new one, given that I got, you know, the wheel of P. Oh, Ah, yes. The, uh, underdog follow-up to Lies of P. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Is that any good? I've seen a shitload of I, people play. People I don't know. Like, people really, people like, really it. like it. That's what I've gotten you out of it, You need to yeah. like parrying. Oh. <laughs> it is very bad parrying. Take it or leave parrying it, but... can be fun. It depends on how fluid everything else but is, You need though. to like perfect parrying, or getting the hell out of dodge. Because like there are there are attacks. Oh come on, that was that was against the Geneva Convention of Shmups right there. <laughs> That's getting a lot of exercise recently, I think. Might need right, to reconvene. This might be a PB. So let me screenshot. Oh, I accidentally. Can I not go back? Twenty-eight I million don't... is your PB. I don't think I can. Oh, what? Twenty-eight. About Twenty-eight. Yeah. 20? 28.5-ish. 2.8. Yeah, 2.8. Oh, sorry. Two, but it got... Wait, what? No, oh, that's 28 million. Oh, shit. I was looking at bluish. Sorry. I was gonna say. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> it's, e it's, trying either, to fucking... it's either, it's either 2.8 or you're God looking damn. at the wrong game. No, I'm looking at the wrong game. Sorry. Uh, actually, so the funny thing is like I 2. actually 9. had 2.9... Yeah. I had 2.9... 3... Or 2.963. Mm -hmm. Which is higher than what I just got now. Boo. You would think that that wheel <laughs> that the wheel would have amounted to more than that. Yeah, yeah. The end of level bonuses are pretty significant too. I guess so. That must be what the actual difference was. If, I don't know. If you do a bad on that, it's kind of. Eh. So either way, two point nine might be where I level out of this game. But yeah. Um, I, I saw some of Clay's playthrough of Lies of P, and for the most part he enjoyed it. The very first time he got to the very end, he got, he was, he, got, he felt pretty burned out when he got there. Uh, so he definitely had to, like, approach Take that break. again the next day and, uh, mm. <laughs> have a better time then. I guess that'll but happen. But he, he definitely felt like, uh, it was a significant ramp up. But yeah, there's like these flashing red attacks that basically you need to perfect parry them, or you need to be nowhere even close to them whatsoever, otherwise you are going to get smashed. What genre even is it of game? Souls-like. Oh, is it Souls-like? Okay. It's, it's absolutely sure. a Souls game. It definitely uh, feels like it's going for, you know, the Bloodborne setting vibe and whatnot. I gotcha. Oh, I picked up missiles. Well, <laughs> rip that run. I mean, just rip that moment. Could be fine later. Hey, yeah, sure. Yeah. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, late for work, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> Have the little square of toast hanging out of its mouth too, just because. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh 
Oh jeez, I got missiles again. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm on There we go. Are you are you dead yet? No, working on it though. I think I think I think I took so long the power ups ended at the end of stage one. Oh really? I'm not aware that's a thing. I guess it makes sense though. I don't know if it's I don't know if it cycles in and out. I don't know if there's timeouts on bosses either. So. Well, if there's not a timeout in fucking Squid Boy on number three, there's definitely not a timeout ever. That's true. That one definitely wants to stick around to the bitter end. I can actually see the oh. weapon that I don't want over there. Oh, I apparently picked up another one, though, that I didn't notice. <laughs> Surprise. Oh, jeez. Come to think of it, the the sh I feel like the shooting noise of the Vulcan might. Oh well, I moved right into that. I'm just gonna reset. The shooting sound of the Vulcan reminds me of a shooting noise in Rendering Ranger R2. Okay, I will probably move on after not too much longer on Chenryu. There's a bomb power up somewhere at the top of the screen. Oh, there it is. Okay. I guess. Like, it was in the top right, and then it just vanished, and then it was at the top left. I don't know. It's like, I was gonna say, I thought they only vanish when they go up the bottom. Oh, well, I didn't want that weapon. Here we go again. It feels like there's one point in both of the first two stages where there's, like, just five things on top of each other, and one of them is a weapon you don't want. Got him. <laughs> freaking, I'll see that coward to go off the freaking bottom of the screen. Yeah, I'll just see? Fucking cowards. Get out of I here. I also died, but he died, which is the <laughs> one part. See? You won. He didn't win. patents this game has. I wonder if one of them is for how long the screen stays around. Can you patent that? Wasting people's time? Seems like a bad patent. Sure. Seems like something Apple would patent. Ooh. You're right, though. Yeah, yeah. So, hey, how about circular fucking <laughs> checkboxes? Pass. Those are radio buttons. Exactly. But apparently, Apple has decided to ignore 40 years of well-grounded UX logic and put circular checkboxes in Vision OS. 
So. I presume this will go much like their decision for, to put the touch bar on laptops, something that literally nobody likes, and ten years later they'll be like, we've done the revolutionary thing of doing away with the revolutionary thing that nobody fucking wanted, because making mm -hmm. you grin and bear it for ten years is also revolutionary. Sounds about right, yeah. Is Vision OS their, their thing for their little VR headset, whatever thing? Yeah. Okay. Which 3500 bucks is... <sighs> yeah, for 3500 bucks, you too can enjoy uh, asterisk circular checkboxes. Hell mm. yeah! Enjoy That's seems just to what I wanted in my life. Do a lot of heavy lifting here. That dude down there shot a bullet right before he went off screen and it got me. Holy shit. Wow. Alright, I'm just gonna move on. Uh, let's do Blue Wish because I didn't do it last week. Ah, your Blue Wish. I was trying to do Blue Wish. Yeah, your Blue Wish is apparently <laughs> functional. Mine now crashes when I, uh, when I try to boot it up. Yeah. No fucking joke. Incredible. What the hell? I have no clue. I have no idea why it suddenly decided that it just doesn't want to be here for this like, world. What changed? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> if I knew, I'd uh, have a better shot at fixing it. Ah, well, knowing about stuff is overrated. <laughs> Thanks, Windows. Like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, like knowing whether you whether when you click on this thing, it is going to check or radio. Hmm. And if it's going to radio, you can't unclick it, so, uh, joke's on you. Uh, well, the joke that, that's, that's the That was what I was going to say, like, that's the most, like, violent part of that UI choice. It does seem like a very Apple move to do, though. They know better. Yep. Than you. They also know better than themselves over the last 40 years, apparently. I mean, you know. Or 30 years. Oh. I guess I need to directly capture this. I always forget. Yeah, you can't really like you know look at your own history to learn from mistakes and shit. Now you got to make brand new ones or the same ones and pretend they're brand new. Is OBS gonna actually capture this game? Probably not. Nah. Uh, well, I feel like I did have this problem last time, but you know. Like, this is why I do it full screen and everything. Come on. Everybody's uh, Blue Wish being cranky today. I feel like I had this happen a couple weeks ago, too. Is Bluish end of February or does that go through March yet? End of March. End of March, March. okay. Oros ends February. <laughs> we'll just try launching again. Mm -hmm. Although maybe we'll have to audible and <laughs> replace so good Blue Wish if it's crashing for everybody. Hmm. Like, yeah, that that's that's the window name. I I don't know <laughs> what else to tell this thing. Uh let's try tweaking that <laughs> setting and see if that does anything. Nope. Maybe I'll try to start mine up just to see if it still works. Okay, I'm gonna pause this. And run my script and see if the blue wish does Wait a does minute. Thing. I just selected. I just selected. Okay. Is that actually working? <laughs> or is that just capturing a still shot? No, that's okay. I captured the magpie exe instead, and that's working. So, all right, sure. <clears throat> I, I don't know. I don't think that's what I had to do last time, but maybe. I don't know. Oh, I need to start my other program so I can actually use the D-pad in this, and then I need to remember to unstart that program afterward. So that I don't confuse the crap out of myself playing something else. Oh, yeah. Uh, Bluish right. starts up for me. <laughs> Not gonna play it, but... Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. We are in business. 
Well, I mean, thanks for uh, checking for it, I guess. Yeah, Ron. just in case. You know, maybe there was something going around where Blue Wish just globally decided. I mean, decided, if someone's Blue no. Wish is going to randomly stop working, it would be the person who has to emulate it in wine or whatever. Right? You would think Forever. so. Wine's not an emulator, though. It is not. Correct. Okay. Emulate asterisk if in wine. <laughs> I mean, it's in the name. Come on. I basically have to look at this as attempting to de-rust after not playing it for over a week. <laughs> Was I ever not rusty at this to begin with? I don't know. I think you need to use something <laughs> before it gets rusty. Alright, I need to be focusing on gun nuts. Not that work here. Oh, uh, random question, Mr. Bond. I mm -hmm. don't know wh why my thought process is going in this direction, no, but, like, mystery. I just... I, I, my brain went, I'm also going to have to de-rest Corridor 7 because I haven't been playing that all week because of Next Fest. Mm -hmm. And then my brain naturally segued to, um... Are you still in contact with Saxon Fox at all? Uh, I can be. Not regularly, um, but, I, yeah, I've got, still got a line. Why, right. what's up? Uh, I mean, I might just I might just get in touch with them via the discussion board on their particular speed game at some point. Because I'm curious. Like, they like, used to run like Stone, stone like stuff? Stone yeah. Yeah, stone. yeah, yeah. And I'm assuming that they ran it before... Also, correct my pronouns if I'm wrong. Yeah, um, they, they, them. <clears throat> I think. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm assuming they ran it before the B-Stone source port existed. Uh, and I'm kind of wondering whether they would find that acceptable to use or not if people were to run it. Um, I think they always run it in like classic DOS with their retro machine. That's what I. Yeah, I thought they used DOS box for. Yeah, uh, I don't know. If, or, no, you're saying they had like, like an like, actual, like an actual hardware. legit like oh, Windows great. 98 DOS based etc. stuff. I wonder what they would Damn. find acceptable though, because like the th the funny thing is like with Corridor Seven, we are finding that like load times are highly variable. Oh, interesting. Um, oh, hence your auto splitter thing, right? Yeah. Partially based on whether you're holding a key or not. So like, I'm not sure. If part, <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure if part of it is actually just like uh, okay. a transition that's skippable. Interesting. But, yeah, like you can. I my original runs were losing two two and a half seconds per level or something, or Wild. two seconds per level at least, over other people's runs. So like when I had an 11:37 and I think Zarek had a 10:30 something, I was probably actually like around tied with him. <laughs> Wild. Um, also, the first stage will take longer to load if you don't uh, abort the previous game from the menu or through F7 first. Oh, interesting. Uh, but yeah, that makes me that makes me wonder, like, what the experience with, with Blake Stone was like in that regard. Especially, like, geez, if they were doing it on actual hardware. Yeah, that's. But yeah, I would imagine that, that like they might want to cut out load times or something to, because like right now, Saxon's the only runner of it, I think. Oh really? Even on uh, speedrun.com? Yeah, Sorry, I see? think so. Huh. Because I think I looked. And that's why I was wondering, like, if other people wanted to run it, what would they find acceptable? Because, like, they're the runner, they're the mod, they're everything. Oh, right wow, now. okay. Yeah, that's a that's a good question. I don't know, I can ask them if you want. I would be curious, but, like, I don't know that anyone else will be touching it anytime soon, but I might add a curiosity at some point, just because it seems like the more runnable of the two out of that are Aliens of Gold, since, you know, if you're going to do the whole six episodes of Aliens of Gold, that's kind of a lot. I mean, yeah, sure. I would imagine, since it doesn't seem like an extremely competitive game, <laughs> that DOS box would probably be acceptable. I don't know about the source port, though. That might be a, a bridge too far, but... Yeah, that's... that's what I'm wondering. It's like the source <laughs> port is way more ergonomic because you can actually, like, find WASD. Right, kind right, of, right. Kind of an improvement. DOS box, you can't even do that. And I, I wonder what... That's a good question. I wonder what control scheme they used, or if they used keyboard only, or what. Asking the important questions. I mean, I'm sure they'd be happy to tell you. There, there have been a couple people in board boosters who have actually done keyboard only runs of Corridor 7. Interesting. And they're still sub 15, so, like, you can still be, you know, at least somewhat. 
I mean, somewhat competitive. Not very competitive because we're in the nine minute territory, but... But you could definitely get it to like sub 12 easily, probably keyboard only, I would have to guess. Is there a time to first jump scare subcategory? Because I'd probably participate in that. <laughs> that would be completely RNG. Oh. I have I have been I have been very rarely hit with the the craziest thing was when we had the uh, when we did the stream for what we know so far about the game, we didn't get the jump scare at all during the stream. Interesting. And I like actually tried to say something about that right at the end, but Derek and Bug <laughs> Doctor didn't hear me and they just ended the stream. So. Oh. So I was like, we should warn people about the damn jump scare. <laughs> I think I've had, like, one legitimate jump scare that actually startled me during a run. Other than that, it's usually been, like, I'm going so fast that I don't see it anyway, I just hear the sound effect. <laughs> oh, careful. Um, need DFS. Ah, I like that though. <laughs> oh, careful. How about the fact that a thunderstorm's rolling through in February? Yeah, that was what pretty wild. Is happening? <laughs> what what is literally what is going on? They even had uh, tornadoes down in Stoughton. That was Jeez, fun. Seriously? Yeah. Nice.
Whoa, careful. Oh! Whoa. Ah! Right. <laughs> right at the end of the boss fight. Let's go. to accidentally get the one up in time on stage three. Seems good. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, which one is this? Is this the weird maid robot thing? Oh, that was dumb. That crap it is. Shouldn't have gotten away with that, but I oh, no! guess that makes up for one of the stupid mistakes before. Not a good way to deal with that one yet. Jeez, I used like five or six bombs in that level? Really? Damn. Oops. That's a lot. That sucks. I mean, it's stage three, but like, oh, yeah, yeah, that's one or two more than I would like. by the bell here. Alright, well, yeah, that's where I eat chicks. I have no idea how to navigate them. Sure, that was a freebie that it just gave me.
is still alive there, huh? There we go. Oh. Oh, well, that's bad. That didn't kill me? Alright, cool. Get a load of that one if you're watching the stream. Holy shit. Get a load of this! <laughs> That definitely shouldn't have worked. I guess it oh, did. I have no bombs again. It's the game thinks so. Oh, none of this should be working. <laughs> Kenny's just engaging panic dodge mode. Hey, that works too. Apparently, like this is this is absolutely the you know that Teletubbies incoming shitstorm gif or whatever where they're just getting like donuts and crap thrown. In. <laughs> Didn't expect Teletubbies to make the deep cut list here, but here we are. Here we are, apparently. Oh, jeez, and I just died to something extremely avoidable as opposed to all the other bullshit that just happened. Oh, sir. Sir. Or madam, I mean, you don't know. I mean, or that, yes, of course. Well, okay, what? Uh, 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 I don't like where I am right now. Excuse me. Alright, here we go. Hmm. Well, let's see where this one ends up. Oh yeah, it's time for hard ride symbols. Only the hardest of ride symbols. Except no substitutes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, saved by the bell again. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, that was extremely dumb. in a real bad situation. Well, at least they gave me the bomb back. Bomba. Stop it, this. Bomba. And I'm using it right now because I don't know how to help it navigate that bullet pattern either. Oh, jeez. Excuse me. Sir, what? Wow. Alright, that was crappy. Oh, <laughs> Bombing this much, probably. Oh, you know what? I hate this phase, though, so. Yeah, there's another bomb. <laughs> that, I should be able to deal with that phase, but good lord, I hate it. The last phase of the first mid boss in the last stage. Where it throws out the party uh, streamers. Party streamers. Very excited yeah, to have that guy. Dinner. Just gets away with all that. Then what a coward! Man. Damn, uh, no cowards again. Why though? Because some days it's just a coward. Yeah, I don't know. Play. The tank had the express lane. Maybe it was the HOV lane. Maybe that's why there were so many bullets coming out. Of hey, it. yeah, there you go. They're being very eco-friendly. Oh, I got hit by that. Wow. Oh, what the fudge? Oh, damn. Wasn't ready for the faster bullets. Uh, 
This dude's down here mouthing off. Meanwhile, there's a mid boss up there. Like, excuse me, you should be done now. You know, I've started realizing that the uh, some of these shots are like Velveeta shell shaped, and I kind of can't take them seriously anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for God's sake! Velveeta shell shaped. Velveeta shell shaped. Interesting. Any bombs? Wait, no, I do. Wait, oh, I was pressing the wrong freaking bomb. Stop me. <laughs> Dope. I could have had a bunch of points for that one. Well, that sucks. Yeah, any more. I hate to see it. I do. I was pressing the bomb button from the other game. <laughs> it's like I forgot to put it on an easier to access button for this one. Stage five of Shenryu does not want you to play the video game anymore. <laughs> no, <laughs> you are to get off the machine immediately. And if you aren't getting off the machine, would you consider getting off the machine? Please and thank you, but mostly no please. Just thank you. Get off the machine. Particularly, uh, so you know how like the stage sections all have numbers as well. Mm-hmm. So it's mm -hmm. like. I died on 5-9. <laughs> what? I see. Good gravy. The long ass this stage. Is the song five. that never runs. I mean, what the hell are they doing? Not ending. I have yet to make it past 5-1 because it's very unhappy Jeez. in 5-1. Yeah, 5-1 is already nonsense enough. Okay, is this going to be enough for a new PV? Yes, it is. We cracked 30 million. Nice. Nice. Barely. 30.5. I did not expect to crack 30 million on my first run. <laughs> my first run out of stage one, I think. I mean, we take those. I mean, we do. On the list of things we take. And I hadn't played this last week. <laughs> Now go for 35. You can do it. I don't think so. Oh, come on. <laughs> Not with that attitude. Maybe I'll maybe I'll try uh no auto bomb again next time. Oh wait, do I need to Oops. I forget if I had problems screenshotting with this one. I think that was Karo's that I had that problem with. Uh nope, hold me. Uh, oh, there you go. I think I usually do this. This one. No, dude, come back here! Ah, oh. that one's dead. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Okay. And of course, I had to continue uh, to fight boss, and he's trivial. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it was 30.46. I thought it was 30.5. Yeah. Oh, okay. Still got a PB, that's the important thing. Yep. That's true. Alright. Uh, I think I'll call it for shmups there. Fair enough. So, I'll see you guys next week.
Alright, see ya. Alright. Have a good night. You too.
I take apart the second boss as well as this, the first one.
crap for the mid boss. Dummy. Well, why'd you go and do something like that? I don't know. I thought I had more to that wave. But I did not, it seems. It's alright. We can still make this work. Ooh, careful. Ooh, okay. Excuse me. Ooh, do, 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 do. Thank you. He's 214 into this? Alright. Damn. Oh, I just gotta not fuck it up. It's probably gonna happen, although I've got three hits, it's probably fine. I don't have a uh, DFS yet. Oops. Rush in. Um, right. Uh, uh, whoa! Ah. <laughs> okay. Ah, you coward! Ah! to five with two hits yet.
Oh, sir. He's still alive, fucker. Oh, right. This goes right. Oh, no. Actually, I don't remember this now. Crap. <laughs> Uh oh. I am probably fucked. Probably fucked. Yes. Okay. Ah! Oh! Oh, I had a little, another little extra dink there. Okay. I don't know where I got that from. Do I get another score bit here at some point? That would be real nice. Score bit? Yeah, a little score life thing. Extend, no, I guess. The, there's the two, and you are long That's past it? the score oh. for pole. Oh, yeah. no. 50 and 200, I believe. Really? Oh, I thought there was another one in there somewhere. Maybe there isn't. Okay. Well! It, it probably uh, coaxed one of the little items yeah. to being health when you sorted it. That's somehow. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, amongst the melee of other things that was going on. Okay, well, that's alright. Just pretty much sight Still read fuck us. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, fuck. Um. Uh! Snuck past the shield! Ah, oh, you bitch. You hate to see it. I really do. It's 1.5 billion. I was on a tear. Couldn't do it though. Well, you made a good attempt at it. Uh huh, uh huh. It's 247. That must have been better than before. Yeah. I think Shit. for my part, I'm gonna sneak away here. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be done too. That was the one. All right. Well, have a good night. Yeah. See ya. See ya. Well, we tried. We got to 1.5 billion. We had a couple more levels than before, 247 versus 244. But we still had like two thirds of that boss to go. So going into there, Oko was probably not going to happen anyways. Uh, but that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be Sunday, 7 p.m. CST. It'll be a long play, so we'll be back to Assault Android Cactus. Some speed runs and an Infinity Drive or two, probably just the one. And then Monday, 7 p.m. CST, we'll be back to the Talos Principle 2. Some more puzzles to start Act 4. That should be fun. Alright, thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Sunday. Bye-bye.